Do companies invest in CSPO courses? Yes. We run many private courses for companies where they look around and they say, oh, we've got about a dozen people who could really benefit from this training. We've got 12 people who want to progress as product owners or in roles where they need to understand product ownership. So at that point, it makes sense to, instead of send them on public courses, ask a trainer to come to them, either virtually or in person, and deliver that course as something that could be a bit more tailored to that organization. If everybody's from the same place, the organization is there, how it works, those stories and things come to life, and you can start talking about how to apply it here. The other way of doing it, maybe you don't have those 12 people, maybe it's just you on your own, other public courses. These are inviting people from all parts of the world, and with the online, it really is all parts of the world these days, okay, to share and learn together. So while you may not get specific to your unique context at your organization, you're gonna hear from lots of different organizations, lots of different contexts, lots of different experiences. One is not better than the other, but they are different and they are both incredibly valuable ways of learning.